We'd like to learn how to calculate year-to-date, month-to-date, and quarter-to-date sales from data extracted from, uh, from an accounting application. We have the total cost on column P. We have also the date that is extracted. This data is extracted all the way from 2018 to the current dates. Now, to do that, we would want to use the data analysis expressions from Power Pivot. The first step is to add our data to the data model under Power Pivot. Go to Power Pivot, then add to data model. Once we've added the data model, let's rename these orders. After renaming to orders, go to design to generate the inbuilt calendar for your data. So go to data, then date table. It's also called the date dimension. Click new. And Power Pivot is going to auto-generate your date dimension or the calendar. Once the calendar has been generated, now you can close Power Pivot window so that you can go back to Excel. Once in Excel, it's now time to generate our measures. So the first measure that we're going to generate is the year to date. So we'll click new measure. Will be total year to date. Then we sum the column containing total cost so we type total cost there then pick then pick the shipping date then close then check the formula for errors we find the error the formula is error free click ok the next measure will be the quarter to date sales so new measure will come from orders this will be qtd sales it will be total QTD for the current quarter, then sum total cost on column P, then close and pick the shipping date, then close like that. Then check that formula for errors, no formula, no errors. The last one is month to date, click new measure, then from there we give a name, call it month to date sales. Then from there it will be equal to total mtd or month to date for the dax function then total cost we pick the total cost from the orders column then we pick the shipping date sum then total cost then we pick the shipping date like that and close and check for errors so there are no errors in my function now once I build my measures, you can see my measures here by going to manage measures. All my three measures are there. Now it's time to now insert a pivot table so that I can do the calculations. So insert pivot table. Then from the pivot table, I'm going to use this workbox data model. Click OK. Then I'm, I want to create a total sales by country because I have a column called country in my data on column H. So I'll come back here and pick orders pick the country countries here then the measures will be at the bottom side of my pivot table so i'll pick year to date sales quarter to date sales and month to date sales then i can format this as numbers that is how to use the DAX functions for year-to-date sales, quarter-to-date sales, and month-to-date sales. Thanks for watching. My name is David Candia.